What's cracking you two? My name's Brody and welcome to another Pokemon trading card game opening and today we are back with my second evolutions boost box to get opened up on the channel. This is the second one from the case so I'm pretty excited. Uh, you can tell this this smile does not lie. Uh, I've been waiting forever to get cracking into evolutions as you guys uh, may or may not know. I've been sick and I haven't been able to crack into packs or make videos and all that sort of jazz. I have been able to crack into packs, but I just have not been able to make videos. But I'm so excited to bring you this today. So we're going to have 18 packs opened in two parts. I'm done talking. Let's get opening. I'm so excited, you guys. Box. If you guys have not checked out box number one, I'll be sure to leave a link in the video description. We actually opened that one up, up in quarters. So there's going to be four different videos uh, that you'll need to check out if you want to watch that one. But we got... It was actually a really, really good box. We got quality pulls. We got quantity and we got quality out of that box. So I'm really hoping that this box can treat us the same. But check that out. If you went to the shops, this is what you'd see uh, if you were buying some loose packs. So check that out. It just looks so good. Like imagine having these in your room, like on a display. That would just be insane. I would love to just have a whole heap of just open boxes, just kind of chilling. But I think we're just going to kick it off with the left side of the box. So we're just going to literally grab the whole left left hand side of the box and go from there. So I might just do that. And let's go. So 18 packs, first part. Let's see what we can do. So we got a Mega Venusaur pack art. So I definitely do still need a lot of cards from this set. Uh, one being the Men uh, Mega Venusaur EX. I think I'm only missing like one of the secret rares. I think my first box gave me four of the secret rares, four different secret rares at that as well. So that's pretty epic. But yeah, these cards are just so throwback. Check out that water energy. Then we got Missy's Determination. Talking about secret rares, there is the Executor. And I think that was the last one I needed. I actually think that was the last one I needed. So that is wild. That's definitely going up back. So I'll throw that one off to the side there. But we've got a Maintenance, a Misty's Determination Reverse, and a Chansey Hollow. So nice. We've got a Secret, Uncommon, and a uh, Hollow in the same pack. So that's, that's epic. That is a solid, solid pack. So this Chansey's got 120 HP with Scrunch and Double Edge. Cool. Such a nostalgic pull there. So we'll throw the hollow just up to, up to back there. I might even move these packs over so we can lean some good pulls up against this box here. If we can get some uh, some epicness on the roll. But that was the first pack. That is crazy, you guys. That is crazy. Okay, this pack wants to open like well, I'm guessing. There we go. Saved. Three and two. What's this second pack got for us today? We got Caterpie, a Ghastly, one of my favorite cards there. We got a, a Diglett, a Charmander, Voltorb, Nidorino, Professor Oak's Hint, whoops, didn't want to go in the pile. <laughs> we got Charmeleon, a Magma Reverse Common, and an Arcanine, the uncommon from uh, base set, making its way into the rare slot. Not a bad looking card, definitely one of the faves. Um, my favorite. That was probably my favorite card when base set was a thing back in the past, like when I was a kid. Just because it had like 100 HP and it was like in the red text and I was like, oh, this card is like so powerful. Uh, and um, no, I was, well, I was young and innocent, you guys. <laughs> I was young and innocent and it just looked really cool. But we've got a switch. A ghastly reverse there, not bad, not bad, not bad. And... A Starmie regular rare, 90 HP with the ability Space Beacon and Star Freeze. So when will we, when will we get our first major hit of this box? I'm just so excited. This set is absolutely amazing. I don't think I could get sick of this set all too quickly. But <clears throat> my fingers are telling me, my kind of beat up fingers at the moment, if you guys did not know, my fingers are looking a little bit rough at the moment because of... Uh, Cleaning chemicals. Cleaning chemicals have like uh, done a little bit of work and destroyed my skin at the moment. So I apologize for that if it's not very camera candy, eye candy-ish at the moment. But we are about to hit something powerful right now, you guys. We're about to hit something huge. So we've got a Caterpie, a Ghastly, Brock's Grit, a Haunter, awesome looking Haunter. We've got a Revive, a Dugong, which is a reverse rare, and... 
A Brox Grit Full Art. I told you guys we're going to hit something huge, and that is definitely, definitely a huge pull right there. Check out this Full Art Trainer card, you guys. Oh my, check that. So it says, shuffle six in any combination of Pokemon and basic energy cards from your discard pile into your deck. Not bad, that's interesting. But let's um let's have a nice close up here of uh Brock's face there. It looks like it has the art from um uh Pokemon Origins where he looks a bit more uh, mature and all that sort of jazz. But yeah, let me know what you guys think of that uh in the comment section below. But that is such an epic poll, you guys. Kicking it off with a full art. I tell you guys, we gotta keep cracking though, we got 18 packs to get through. And uh Rendering is already going to be long enough as is because I talk way too much. So let's keep cracking and see what we can get. So I'm definitely hoping when it comes to the break department, I, I'm really hoping to get the Nine Tails and the Nido King. They're definitely the faves. There's only like four breaks in this set, but they're definitely the faves for sure. I know in box one I kind of got uh, I got the the worst ones in my opinion, but there's a reverse rare there and a Doug Trio. Uh, yeah, I got the the break cards that I didn't really want to pull, but I kind of needed to pull at the same time for the uh, for the set binder. So it was good to knock them out, but it would have just completed that box and definitely made it probably one of the best boxes I've ever opened uh, when it comes to pulling cards that I, I really like from a boost box. Definitely would have made the box if the breaks were just like mint, like mint. But we got Caterpie and then Metapod. Oh, there's no Butterfree. There's no Butterfree in the set. That's disappointing. That's, but we get a Caterpie Reverse there. That's a nice little themed pack there. And a Farfetch'd. So nothing all too fancy there. That Brock Grit looks so good, you guys. Let me know in the comment section below what you guys think of that Brock Grit. But that is such a nice pull. Such a nice pull. Let's go three, two. So we have a Growlithe, a Rattata, Electabuzz, Magikarp, a Drowsy, Energy Retrieval, a Kukuna, Slowbo, uh, Slow, Slowbo, Slowbro sp <laughs> Spirit Link, a Poliwhirl, shout out to Ace Trainer Liam, and a Mega Slowbro EX. Let's go. Such a cool looking card. I do love the gold highlights on the border. I reckon that's a very nice touch that, that they did with this set. But check that out. 220 HP with LOL. Is that LOL? LOL Roll Spin. Okay. LOL LOL LOL. Is that what the slow bro says when it spins? Lol lol lol. <laughs> Let's go. Lol 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 in the comment section below, you guys, for slow bro. Slow bro? Yeah, slow bro. <laughs> I kept thinking slow king for some reason. I don't know what it is because of like the shell eating around uh, mega slow bro there. Kept thinking slow king. But we got magic up, seal, polywag, so much water. And then we got the grass, we got tangler, voltorb. De Evolution Spray, Magma, Switch, Crystal Onyx Reverse, Common, and a Beedrill re uh, Regular Rare. So that one's got 120 HP with Poison Sting and Swarming Sting. Alrighty, so we got to be heading on towards the halfway point of this box. We're 9 minutes, 9-ish, uh, I'd say 9-ish minutes in. At the moment, heading on towards 9 minutes anyway. So not too bad, not the greatest. Definitely going to be a long opening for sure. But we got a Sandshrew, Vulpix, Nidoran Mail, a Growlithe, Rattata, Super Potion, DCE, shoutouts to Durham's Pokemon, definitely loves that card. Nine Tails Break, I definitely wanted this card, you guys. Nine Tails Break. Wow. Definitely one of the faves for sure. And we got an Electrode there. With uh, the ability Buzzap, Buzzap, Thunder, and Headbolt. But check that out, you guys. Nine Tails Break. Awesome. I totally called that. I definitely wanted that one. I may not I may not seem overly excited about it, but I really wanted that card. And the fact that there's now an Alolan Nine Tails and, like, Vulpix and stuff is just, just makes it so much better. Because there's the potential now for there to be an Alolan, like, Nine Tails Full Art or, you know what I mean, something epic like that. You imagine a Alolan Nine Tails Full Art card in a Sun and Moon TCG set. I can totally see them doing it as well, purely because uh, I'll, they like to show appreciation for new things that they bring into the games. But we've got a Magic Carp here and a Nido King Hollow, so that's pretty cool. Not bad, 150 HP of the Rumble and Tail Swing. 
cool, cool. Uh, but yeah, so they like to uh, show a lot of appreciation for the the new powerful things that they bring into the game. So for example, through the whole XY series, one of the main features was the megas and mega full arts and all that sort of jazz. But yeah, with um, the Sun and Moon TCG series that's coming out, I can totally see them doing something crazy. Like they've got the GX cards, but I think they'd do something else for these Alolan cards. And I, I'm, I'm just so excited. Like being a TCG tuber, that's something to look forward to. And they're just fully revamping the, de the design of the cards and just going all out <laughs> with this Sun and Moon uh, set. But we got another reverse rare Hitmonchan. Like another reverse rare, this one being a Hitmonchan and an Arcanine regular rare. But yeah, that is exciting. Let me know your thoughts and what you think uh, they're going to do with the Sun and Moon TCG series. So obviously, like I was saying, they've, they've announced the GXs, but I think they're going to do more. Like they're definitely going to do more than just the GX. There's going to be some sort of unique new full art. Just This is just my opinion, definitely not official information by any means. But yeah, let me know your... Uh, you guys, your opinion in the comment section below. I'd love to love to hear what you guys have to say about that. But we got a Darkness Energy Reverse. That is an epic pull. That one's definitely going up the back. And we got a Doug Trio Regular Rare. So we're definitely on a bit of a dry, dry spell at the moment. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. So these codes, at the moment, I'm, I'm putting them off to the side because I'm going to save them for TCGO Amity After Shows or like just... Um, openings in general for you guys just uh, as a little bit of extra content maybe like a double upload throughout the day I don't know let me uh, know what you guys think about that but we got a lightning energy a full heal Porygon Pidgeot spirit link a Machoke that one's a reverse uncommon and a mega blastoise EX let's go let's go so it's got 220 HP with hydro bombard not bad Gotta love that XY base reprint Blastoise there. That is pretty cool. So how many packs we got left? We got five more packs to go. So we got, uh, what's that, two Charizards. Yeah, we'll just crack into them in that order. There's like one of each pack art. But then we got a double off of uh, Charizard here. So hopefully, I'm, I'm really hoping for the Mega Charizard Y full art. I reckon that'll be such an epic card to see in person. So hopefully this box can treat us exceptionally I have faith, I have faith that we can get the finest of pulls. But we got a Pikachu, a Magnemite, Ponyta, Haunter, a Secret Uncommon, Secret Uncommon, a Imakuni's Do Duo, not bad, throw that one up the back there. We got a Metapod, a Metapod Reverse with Stiffin, that's no comment, and Dugong, <laughs> no comment, no comment there. I don't know what was going through their head when they thought that was okay. Let's put Stiffin as an attack on a Pokemon card. No comment. No comment. But we've got a Drowsy, a Ponyta, Nidoran Male, a Marchop, Growlithe, a Flying Pikachu Secret Uncommon. Not bad, not bad. Let's throw that one on the back. we got a Haunter, Maintenance, Growlithe Reverse Common, and a Raticate regular rare. Three more packs to go. Then we're halfway through the box already. Halfway through the box. Like definitely being spoiled. Like this this left hand side of the box has definitely spoiled us so far. Let's throw that off to the side. So much rubbish. So much rubbish everywhere. It's gonna be a mission to clean this up <laughs> once I'm done opening. But we've got a ghastly, Growlithe, a metal energy. That looks really weird. Really weird on camera. It looks like the ink was really heavy on you guys probably won't, won't be able to tell on cam but um that that's interesting but we've got a potion pokedex polywell a uh, reverse rare arcanine cool that's 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 an awesome poll for nostalgic reasons for myself and a mega charizard yex just talking about you hopefully that is a sign you guys hopefully that is a sign i'm really hoping we can get that full art mega charizard because check out that Brox Grit too. Oh, man. Oh, man. You guys, these pulls. These pulls are straight quality. Like, so far, like, we're not even done this part yet. And the pulls have just been insane. 
insane, you guys. So let's let's get cracking. Let's finish off these these last two packs. Maybe we can get that second full art out of these last two packs. You never know. Let's throw that off to the side. Three, two. Let's go. So we've got a star you, a do duo, weedle. <laughs> March up. I kind of just held on to that for too long. It's like a weedle. <laughs> Blast toys. Another reverse rare. That's that's awesome. That is perfect for the reverse rare set. And a Mewtwo. You should have been a holo. You should have been a holo Mewtwo. But let's move on to the final pack of box two, part number one. So I'm really I'm really excited for part two. I'm so excited for part two. Let's go. Three, two. And let's see if we can finish it off on a high note. But I'm definitely pleased with what we've got so far. But we've got a Machop, Growlithe, Pikachu, a Psychic Energy, Charmander, Revive, Misty's Determination, a Coughing, a Reverse Common Sandshrew, and a Starmie Regular Rare. So we couldn't finish it off on the more powerful of notes. Check out all the bulk. That is all the bulk from 18 packs. <laughs> but let's have a quick recap of part number one. So I'm just going to literally go through everything kind of just how it is right now. I'm not going to sort anything out. We're just going to go through it as is. So everything's going to be really scattered. But we got a reverse rare Raichu, Arcanine, Secret Uncommon Flying Pikachu, Imakuni's Duo Duo, a reverse energy, Hitmonchan, Nido King Hollow, a reverse mag rare magneton, reverse rare dugong, hollow chancy, the secret uncommon um, executor there. We got the mega slowbro. We got the mega Charizard. Like look at these megas though. Mega Charizard Y. A mega Blastoise EX. Like a oh man, that is power right there. Like getting those is straight power alone. But we got the nine tails break here. Such an epic pull, once again. One of the two faves, fave breaks from the set. And then we got the Brock's Grit Full Art, which is just such an incredible card in its in its own right. But yeah, I'm I'm so pleased with that part, you guys. So if you guys enjoyed today's opening, be sure to drop a like down below. Um, and let me know in the comment section below how you'd like me to open these booster boxes. I've kind of been shuffling and chopping and changing how I've been doing it. So my first box was in quarters because I was a little bit unwell. This one's in halves just because it kind of just flows well. Um, but I can do a Durium, Durium style full box opening where I skip the commons and have a full box in one video. Or I can just do a long, long opening where I talk for like 40, 50 minutes and open the full box. Uh, but yeah, let me know in the comment section below how you'd like me to open these boxes. W would you like it in one uh, full boxes per video, halves, quarters, thirds? Let me know in the comment section below. Uh, but with that said, be sure to drop a like down below if you guys enjoyed. And I look forward to seeing you guys in part number two or just another one of my Pokemon videos. Thanks for watching. Peace.